Let's look at example three. Zima has 10 kilograms of a radioactive material which appears to continuously decay at a rate of 100% per year. How much will she have after three years? Now you're thinking, look, if this is decaying at 100% per year, you expect it to all be gone after a year. But you also have to remember that you have 10 kilograms of it. After half a year, you're going to have, you know, like, like half of the 10 will have decayed, right? So you no longer have 10 grams. So it's not, it's not, it's decaying a little bit less and a little bit less each time. Let's see what happens. We're going to use our, our same formula. Okay, so the final amount is equal to the principal amount times e to the power of rt, rate times time. So the principal amount, we have 10 kilograms. The rate, it's decaying. We're losing 100%. So that's minus 100%, minus 1. And the time is 3 years, so times 3. And again, you calculate the time. 10 times e to the power of negative 3. So 3 negative equals point. 4978. So that's pretty neat. That logically, you'd expect there to be none left after a year, but actually what happens is you have half of a kilogram left. And that's it for E. Have a good day.